Welcome everyone to tableauinfo.com. Today we are going to talk about sorting. Let me try to sort your life today. <laughs> so today I don't have many slides, but we will have more hands-on experience. Uh, so we'll do sorting with rank, top and bottom end, sorting with highlight. Let's jump over to the worksheet. So my first question is, uh, this is one of the most common and irritating part of sorting when you try to drag uh, more dimensions to your rows or say columns and you're not able to sort it. For example, I want to sort here, but you can see you don't have proper sorting over there. I want to sort within my region and I'm trying to do all sorts of tricks, but I'm not able to, as you can see. So how to solve such problem? Okay, let me duplicate it. So let me start with the merge part, this is, which is a sort of traditional one, but let me try to create that one. We will make use of uh, a calculation. On subcategory. Let me make that or maybe I can make use of the present calculation over there. So you have to just do region plus subcategory. After that, you need to drag it. And after that, I'll just go over there and I'll say solve. This image. So I can see within my region, I can see proper sorting. Yes, I can see. And after that, if I want to highlight, I can do that. So this is a simple way, but I'm not a great fan of this way uh, because when you already have rank over there, so let me try to make use of uh, uh, ranking. So we have already achieved here because ranking will give you uh, lots of options. For example, if I sh show you the solution, I have uh, the option to pick top five and bottom five. So I have not only sorted uh, over there, but at the same time, I'm able to get top and bottom end. For example, here you can see top three within central region. I can see top three and bottom three as well. So how to do that? Let me duplicate it. Okay, uh, I'm going to make use of rank calculation. Rank me. Rank according to the sum of sales. Here you go. It is not making more sense over there because it is ranking at table level. See, it is going, going down from top to bottom. So now I need to tell Tableau that, okay, I need to edit my table calculation and tell that, okay, these are the specific dimension towards I need to move on. And here I should move towards subcategory with the region as a partition field. It make, makes sense now you can see. So I have got the first part. What about the second part? I want to, yeah, that is the better part. And when I, it was telling you about the previous version or previous way of doing the same thing. You don't have option of doing calculation on the top of that. Now I can create one, uh, say parameter. I don't want to create it again because it's very simple. Integer one to 20, such type size one. And I would say show parameter. And that is what you see over there. So what can be the calculation to achieve top and bottom end? Uh, let me try to do that. And before that, I think you should know what is number of partitions because we are going to make use of that size 
will drag it over there now you get to know again i'll have to tell so size is the number of partitions but i need to take that partition at region level so i need to tell tableau okay you need to go around a long subcategory now it is fine so this is number of partitions within a region within all the regions with respect to each and every region okay i got this now what to do now i need to create a calculation and i say i say create a calculation i will already already have rank mu so let me go step by step rank mu should be less than top and bottom mu does that make sense so this will give you at least top n and i say i say true so you can see it is giving me maybe i need to make it make it less than equal to so this makes sense because it is simply checking that okay my parameter 3 should be uh oh, okay my rank should be less than equal to my parameter so 1 2 3 you get 3 what about the bottom n you need to just make a slight change over there you know we have access to the number of partitions so what could be the, what could be our calculation so let us check now okay first part is okay rank new less than equal to top the other part would be the difference like for example rank i have parameter 3 so 17 minus 3 is equal to 14 so my rank should be greater than 14 as well to get the bottom 3 so that would be your formula that means my rank my rank new should be greater than the number of partition minus top and bottom n now i will convert this to top n bottom n bottom test Did I mess it up? Number of partitions minus top and bottom n. Correct. Rank new should be greater than number of partition. There is seventeen minus top and bottom n. There is three seventeen minus three. that was saying i i should be using or not and it should be or logically right <laughs> okay so I, i i got this part as well last but not the least l3 solution one this is a new one where uh, this is a bit different from the earlier solutions and worksheets that we had here you see uh, different months within that month you have different subcategories and these are ranked according to the sales and at the same time i have got the option to highlight my subcategory so table is at the top for the month of january so i should be able to select the year and after that i should be able to highlight my particular subcategory so that i can for example this is not 
as per the ranking it is not over there so i need to increase the rank uh, range so that i can see that option so how to do that so i should go to the l3 question so this is my question i need to sort my subcategories with respect to different months so if chair is looking at the top for the year 2014 it should come at the top and at the end i will have highlight option as well so like this for the month 2014 if i go to the l3 question for the month of 2017 uh, paper should be at the no sorry storage or chair should be at the top chair is at the top so how to achieve that l3 question so Again, we'll have to create a rank. We'll make use of the same rank. It is looking messy, but then we'll, uh, we'll sort it out. It's all about uh, knowing the specific dimensions. Mm -hmm. So we are halfway through. So chair is at the top. It is coming nicely. I can check for the other years as well. For example, 2017 binders at the top. Let me check with the solution. 2017 binders at the top and the first ones are at the bottom. Yes, maybe there we have selected 16 only that's why now the second part how to uh, add the color coding nothing we'll have to just create one new parameter that parameter should be created on subcategory like this and after that we'll have to create a little calculation over there that is nothing You have to do just select a subcategory this is the parameter is equal to attribute of subcategory and after that you'll have to do this color coding you'll have to uh, there are two three parameters over there so i need to make ensure that i select the correct parameter as show as control select a subcategory select a subcategory i'll drag it over there now we can see it is very easy to select and highlight that very particular subcategory as well so uh, i hope it, it really helped you and uh, do go to my website subscribe to youtube video so that you can get more videos like that and also i'll try to paste uh, my tableau public link so that you can download this worksheet as well at my youtube description so uh, you can maybe after two three days not today but i'll do that so thanks a lot everyone see you soon